What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash this up by the being notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs, caps, two sides, and everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. <clears throat> if it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading for all signs. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. If you'd like to donate, it's Hyper Sister 05. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash app, no Venmo. It's very private, confidential, private, confidential way to donate if you choose to donate. Love and appreciate you guys. Just saying. Okay, so I received a channel message. I already did daily tea for today. Um, and if anybody wants to check out the newest channel that I revamped, it was hashtag glow up. Now it's hashtag Leo Gang, all caps with the exclamation point at the end. You are welcome to check it out. It's for any aspects of Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Moon, Heaven, or Jupiter charts, and um, cross watchers. Um, it already has one uh, video posted. I did it last night. It's about a 35 or 36 minute video. It's on the channel if anybody wants to check it out. Just saying. Okay, so I received channeling. We're gonna do it. Do the daggum thing. Just say it, just saying. Okay. So the channeling I received was the feds have, I heard feds, so federal agents have been watching the um, for years. I heard for years. Um, an illegal business and black magic COVID. Um, soon they're about to get involved and they're about to get involved heavy. It is about to shock the hell out of these people. They never thought they would get caught. But it's about to happen soon and quickly. That's what I heard, man. Well, you know, here's the thing. Um, feds are smart. They're smart, man. And the thing is, is I'm sure, and I didn't hear this. This is just my deductive logic and reasoning on this. They, I'm sure they wanted to build a case. And they wanted to build a solid case. So what not a better way to build a solid case than to sit back and watch for years, let them do their, I mean, I hate to be crass, but this is just the truth, their fuck shit. And I'm uh, sorry if that offends somebody, but I'm just being serious because that's what it sounds like these people were doing. I heard black magic, COVID, and illegal business. So sit back and let them do what they're doing, thinking they're not going to get caught, build the case on them, and then come in. I mean, what not better way to do it than that way? I mean, I'm sure you don't make it as a federal agent by being dumb. <laughs> I'm sure you have to have a, a certain IQ. You have to uh, pass certain mental competency strategies and tests and um, what have you, what have you, not only intellectually, but mentally and physically to become a federal agent. I'm not a federal agent. I don't know any federal agents, at least not to my knowledge, but I would assume that would be the case. And I would assume you have to have a certain IQ level. So these people are not dum-dums. I heard these people never thought they would get caught. So obviously the feds have a much higher IQ level than these people. And that's just the truth. Someone is getting such a huge wake-up call. Someone's getting such a huge wake-up call. I mean, I'm just being for real, for real. I'm serious. I mean, what not better way to sit back and let them basically shoot themselves in the foot, not literally, but metaphorically, and then come in. What not better way to do it? Really, I mean, collecting all the evidence as they do their crazy stuff. I mean, it's some kind of black magic, COVID, and illegal business of the past. But it sounds like it went on for years. So really, what not better way to do it? I heard they're about to come in soon and quickly. And um, they're not going to mess around when they do it. Because, and I think, I think, I don't know because I'm not feds. I'm not them, but my deductive, deductive logic reasoning would be because they already have their evidence. They already have what they need. They already have what these people did. So why not come in soon and quickly and get them? Um, because they already have what they need. Um, that's my deductive logic reasoning on this, you know, but um, I'm not the feds. <laughs> But it makes sense. It makes complete sense. And I'm just being for real. I heard that these people never thought they'd get caught. So 
I think they might have thought they'd get caught at first, but once they didn't, they thought they got away with it. So they kept doing it and doing it and doing it because they thought they could get away with it. But now cycles have completed, cycles have closed. Sounds like the black magic. I think it's this black magic coven I've been pulling in that's currently disbanded now, where deaths have already occurred and more are about to occur. I think it's that one, but you plug it in how it resonates. But um, but the thing is, is yeah, I think that's what it is. I think they might have thought they got would have got caught at first. That's what I think. They um a particular agent has been watching for a long time time a long time they are about to come in it's about to shock these people and one of these people knows this person Ooh, okay a particular agent has been watching a long time a long time i heard so i mean i heard years my god years so this one agent one federal agent mask or femme it could be you sir ma'am I mean, I'm pulling this in for a reason. So maybe you, federal agent, watches my channel. Possibly. Or somebody who's connected to you watches my channel. But you've been watching a long time. So you've been watching this illegal business, this Black Magic Coven, that sounds like where cycles have completed. So the illegal business has completed, I'm presuming. And the Coven has been shut down or disbanded. You've been watching them for a long time. I heard you're about to come in soon and quickly, and you know at least one of these people in the disbanded coven or the illegal business or what have you, what have you. I heard it's going to shock that person when you come in, swooping in. And I don't think you're going to be in, um, I think you're going to come in um, and mean some business, not come in and um, swoo some, you know, woo somebody and chat it up with them. I think you're going to come in to handle some business, sir, ma'am, agent. Um, but you do know, you agent know, you know, know somebody in that disbanded coven or the illegal business or both. I don't know who it is. It could be an ex-lover, ex-friend, a family member, uh, um, somebody you grew up with. I'm not sure. You have to plug that person in, how it resonates, sir, or ma'am, sir, ma'am. Whew. But I heard you're, you're going to come in. You ain't going to be, you're going to be being in business. Business. And I don't blame you. I don't blame you. I'd be meaning business too if I was an agent in that situation, but I'm not a federal agent. I don't know. Experiment. Okay. By the way, I want to disclaimer this while um while I am um shuffling. Um okay, so I put four uh well, I haven't put all four thousand out yet. I put about 2,000 business cards out. I've got 2,000 or more, one more box over here to go. So 2,000 more to go. 2,000 are currently out in my city. They uh, put them out within the course of about three days. 2,000 more to go. And I'll put those out today or tomorrow. Uh, my business cards, I'll show them to y'all. But I've been getting these text messages from people. I have people that have my business cards and um asking for full body massages this is my business card you guys i don't it doesn't say full body massage on there it's very inappropriate asking for a full body massage from somebody that's offering you free online readings you're not even having to pay um if you're watching this sir or ma'am that sent me that inappropriate text i'm almost a 39 year old woman and you're texting me, asking me for a free, um, not for free, for a full body massage. Um, I hope you realize how inappropriate that is. Um, just saying, just saying. Somebody needs to hear that. All right, courtship and change. Number four, nine can be very significant numbers in one's life. Number four, nine, it could be a possible age of you or somebody you're connected to or any other significant number in one's life. Number four, nine, courtship and change upright. So change coming to this um, case situation. Um, I heard they've been, uh, the feds have been building a case for a hot minute. Um, they wanted these people to think they got away with it. And I heard that people did think they got away with it. But there's about to be huge changes here. Huge. Oof. There's about to be huge changes here. Huge. So um, 555 change energy. Huge changes. Um, I think the feds are about to swoop in. They're about to swoop in. They wanted these people to think they got away with it. 
to build the case, to build the evidence on them. It's regarding a black magic coven and um and um evidence and um I'm thinking it's sex I think sex trafficking had a lot to, I think it's secret seven. I didn't hear secret seven, but I think it is secret seven, but you plug it in how it resonates. But I think it's sex trafficking, uh isolating people, bullying, targeting, harassing, um, maybe prostitution in there. Secret Seven had a little bit of everything. So um you have to plug it in how it resonates. But however it resonates, it was it's definitely a black magic coven and an illegal business of the past. Um But if we're talking Secret Seven, they basically tried to kill the mother. They tried to kill the mother behind the scenes, but they didn't want the people in the camera to know that. Um, and they were making all this money off her and her children, probably pedophile, pedophile pedophilia s type energy. And I hate to say that, but I'm serious. All while behind the scenes, they were partying it up with drugs and alcohol. And they were trying to kill the mother behind the scenes, trying to make her look like she was a drug user and an alcoholic when she really wasn't. It was a whole hot mess express. And I'm just being for real. But you plug it in how it resonates. Courtship. Feelings are about to be formed between a masculine energy to a femme energy. The femme energy is not going to return them. Know this. Not until things in her life starts getting balanced out. Oh, okay. I heard there's about to be feelings formed. Um, a masculine is about to form a feeling feelings for fem energy, but I heard no that the fem's not gonna return the feelings until things start getting balanced out in her life. So until changes occur in her life. I think she might have children, because we have child card, child or children, and I think things have been very imbalanced for her. Um, I think maybe this Coven was targeting her. And maybe the illegal business was focusing around her or her and her kids. False person reversed. She's real. She tells it how it is. I think she tells it 100. She's not dead. Um, we have coffin reversed. And whoever's about to come in, I think it might be a mature man. Mature masculine energy that's about to develop feelings for her. Or a fin that takes on heavy masculine. Um, and I think he might live outside her community. So we have community reversed. And then we have main male. So yeah, I think he lives outside our community because we have community reversed. Uh, but he hasn't come into her life yet. I think he's about to. I, for some, I think he might be an uh, FBI agent, possibly. I didn't hear he was, but he might be fem energy. But um, if you're the fem energy in this situation, he's going, he hasn't come into your life yet, but he's about to. Uh, but it's regarding some kind of coven energy and illegal business of the past. I feel for some of you fem energies, you were the one that was taken advantage of with the illegal business of the past and the coven energy. Um, and maybe he wants to come um, um, speak to you about it, um, question you, speak to you about it, um, interview you, question you, maybe interrogate you. You plug it in how it resonates. Um uh, but I heard he's going to develop feelings for you. He's going to want to date you, courtship, I'm feeling. I'm feeling he's going to date you. I didn't hear he's going to want to, but I feel he's going to because I heard he's going to develop feelings for you, but you're not going to develop feelings for him because I heard you want, you want things balanced out in your life. You're focusing on changing your own life. And I strongly feel you have child or children with the child card. And I think you've made it very clear and you're very real about that. And I think you'll make it very clear and very real to him that basically you're not interested in dating anybody or being with anybody. And I think that includes him until there's some changes made in your life. If you were the victim, you or your children were the victim of this. Um, or not. You plug it in how it resonates. But whoever this is for, your femme energy. And there's about to be a masculine energy or femme that takes on heavy masculine. With the mature man and the main male card that I feel lives outside your community. Come into your life. He hasn't come in yet, but he's about to. Um, and he's going to be very romantically interested in you, ma'am. But 
I think you're about to be real with him. Be very real with him. It's exactly what I think. False parts in reverse. Let me see if I hear anything else. You want to, feminine energy, you want to see some very positive change. And you're going to make it very clear to him. And it's going to wake him up in a huge way. Okay. Her feminine energy, you're going to want to see some very positive change. And um, it's going to wake him up in a huge way. And um, I think when you voice that you want to see some huge change. With the change. I think you were the victim in this, ma'am. Or your kids were. Or you and your kids were. He's going to be seeing hearts in his eyeballs. And you're going to want to. And you're going to be seeing change. I think you're already seeing change. Um, I don't think he understands. The trauma you were put through. Whoever you were. You are. You were put some, through some serious trauma. And you want change. You want betterment. You want. 555 five, five change for you and your kid or kids. I strongly feel you have kid or kids. We have the child card upright. And I strongly feel there might have been a pedophile ring involved in this too. Possibly. I didn't hear it was, but possibly. And I think your kids were the targets. And I, I'm serious. But you won't change. He's going to see hearts in his eyeballs. Um, and you're going to be very real with him and tell him you want to see some damn change. I heard it's going to wake him up in a huge way, so I, I, it sounds like he needs to hear it. You plug it in how it resonates, ma'am. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. There will be huge change here. Huge change. He's going to develop deep respect for you. There will be huge change here, huge change. He's going to develop deep respect for you. Well, that's good. That's good. I heard there will be huge change here, ma'am. There will be huge change. I think you being very real with him, false parts are reversed. You going to be very real with him is going to wake him up. He's going to come in with hearts, heart emojis in his eyeballs. He's going to want more to you. You're going to want change. And honestly, it sounds like you're very reasonable and you are very a realist. You understand the world and what you want out of life and what you want for you and your kids. He's going to come in with heart emojis. I think he's financially set. He's financially stable. He, you know, I don't think he has to worry about money or bills or maybe kids for some, some of these masculine energies, but you do, you do. So I think you're going to be real with his ass. And I heard once you do, it's going to be, it's going to be eye opening for him. So I think the heart emojis is going to turn into eye open emojis. Like, oh, well, this chick, she really, um, she, I mean, she's real world. She's a realist. Um, she knows what the hell she's talking about. She knows what she wants out of her life. Change, change, change of the emojis yeah. in his eyeballs. That's what I'm feeling. He hasn't come in yet, but he's about to. All right. Well, let me see if I hear anything else. Okay. Okay. Now, I want to say you, Fem, and uh, I didn't hear anything else, but you, Fem Energy, the one he's about to come into, that he's going to see hearts in his eyeballs, I don't think you're a member of the Coven. Was not a member of the Coven or the illegal business. Was not a member of, okay, that's confirmation. Okay, so you were not a member of the Coven or the illegal business. I think you were the victim or victims. And I think your child was victim or victims. So you, Fem Energy, the one you're going to have a very real conversation with, with this masculine energy. I don't think you've met him yet, or if you have, it's been a long time, like a person in your past. But I feel for a majority of you guys, you've never met this person. I think he might have, um, I think this might have been the person that was following this Coven for years. Um, is what I think. Um, but I heard he's he knows a member of the Coven from the past. And um, but it's not you. 
you were not a member of the coven. I think you were a victim of it, ma'am. The one he's going to come in with tar emojis in his eyeballs. And you're going to wake him up. So I just want to make that clear, okay? All right. Let's see if I hear anything else. All right, I did. All right, I love you guys so much. Everybody have a good day. I hope this helped. If you think anyone else will like my channel, please feel free to share it on social media and word of mouth. Very much appreciate it. Love you guys and namaste.